Okay, hey you guys, it is I again with a little bit of a switch up to the plan, but that's okay, we're still trucking along. We're, well, if you don't already know from the lack of videos this month, we took a break this month so that we can track my ovulation, went and got a digital ovulation um, test from, by Clear Blue, um, just went to Walmart and snagged it up. And I kind of like it because you either get a yes or no, a circle or a smiley face. Smiley face means you're at your surge, or you have LH surge, no circle, no surge. Um, so we're going to do that. And look, crazy thing is, I the day before my window, I had a smiley face. So I'm like, what the hell? And the day after, I had a smiley face. And the day after that, I didn't have a smiley I had a circle. So... That's kind of weird because my I'm supposed to ovulate today, but when I took the test, like that very first day, I felt like I ovulated, and I thought that was weird. So I don't know what's going on, but I'm really happy we took this break because now I can, you know, we would have wasted to if I went and got those um, the regular dye because I probably would have read it wrong or went exactly by my calendar, which is not always right. Um, so I really can't go off of that. But my body said I was at my peak on the very, the day before and the very first day of my window. And today I was supposed to ovulate, but I don't know, I might take a test tomorrow. I was supposed to take one today, this morning, but I had, I was in my head, planning out my day and getting myself together. And it just skipped my mind. So hopefully I didn't do like ovulate or anything, but I don't know. Some people, they say they get a smiley four days apart or you know what I mean? Like it's not a consecutive set of smileys, but, um, like a break. I don't know. I don't know how the body works anymore. My body is a mystery and it's, um, it's Pandora's box and that's crazy <laughs> but so we took a break this month next month we're gonna try again we're gonna order instead of ordering so we can get our stuff the day um, within our ovulation window we're gonna, I'm gonna see if I can get it here like two days before the ovulation window because I know the the tanks we can keep it for seven days no you keep it for seven without being charged 14 days total is the longest you could have but I'm not trying to be paying $30 a day. Is it 30 or 15 I don't know because I don't pay it. Um, I just pay for it to get here. It costs a lot for it to get here. But that's okay. Hopefully, we, you know, after this little break and this little bit of observation, we know what to do for next time. If not, we'll just keep on going. But I'm going to stick with this digital test because I really like them. And, yeah. Um... I want to say something else, and I don't know what it is. The wife's birthday was last week. Um, and we had a little mini something at home. And we went to the mall. We went out of town. Not stay. We went out of town for her birthday. Um, just go shopping. I was like, hey, babe, you get whatever you want. I'll fork the bill. I don't know, whatever I could do to make her smile, that's it, because she does a lot to make me smile. But, um, next week, uh, next week we'll be going to, no, not next week, this week, we're going to Florida, because we had a passing in the family, and she was a really, really nice lady. So, we're going to go and pay our respects. Um... And then we're gonna try this baby making thing back again. Um, hopefully, it can be when we have people do crazy things when we just look outside the window, like seriously. But hopefully, we could make a love baby because you know next month is you know the month of love and whatnot. I'm always trying to make something out of. <laughs> 
you know, the baby be a Christmas gift, the baby be a New Year's gift, the baby be a her birthday gift. Like the baby's gonna be something. Like you know, like if we if we conceive in February, I'm gonna tell my child like you was a love child, like because you was conceived in February. I think it's cute. Whatever. This sun is like directly in my eyes, but I can see it's just it's quite blinding. But yeah. I think that's all I wanted to say because I haven't made a video in a long time, like I said. Um, I'm in a good headspace right now, better than I was after, you know, I thought I was pregnant. But, um, you know, we're going to keep on trucking on. You know, our time will come. Our time will come. I would love to be pregnant before I turn 30, though. That would be awesome. But if that's not in the Lord's, you know, design... If he wants me to wait till I'm 31, then we'll just wait till I'm 31. But would love, love, love to just, I don't know, read and see the little sign that says you're pregnant or get the cross or get the double lines or whatever test I decide to pick up. Um, I don't know. I'm just in a good mood today. And it's Tuesday. Oh, well. All right, you guys. I will holler at y'all later. Bye.